Hi, it's Tanya with Owners Up, and today we're going to be covering how to do a monthly review. So in Owners Up, at the end of the month, we actually go over the old framework, and we put this framework for you guys in a PDF, but we have a couple more questions, and our app does a bit more, but I wanted to get you guys started. So one of the things, if you look at the PDF, you would print it out, and you would print out a bunch of them. So you can just clip them, do whatever you need to do to put them in a book style, and then you would write down the important stats. So here are some suggestions, revenue, number of new clients, website visitors, and subscribers. And maybe if you want to add other ones out, you would put them there too. You would want to measure overall, how do you feel this past month? Were you feeling great and awesome? Just rate it number 10. If it wasn't a good month and you're just like, oh geez, then you might want to put a two. And how is this month different from the previous month? So really take the time and read all your daily wrap ups as we call them, the business journals and assess like, what did I do last month and how was this better or worse than the previous month? Was there any progress and really document all of that and put it in there. And then you want to listen, describe all the moments, the aha moments, wins, everything you want to celebrate, any clients you lost, any clients you won and any personal event that you want to put right in there. And this will help you where like, if you had to reflect and do an annual review, this will give you, you can just look at that month, whatever you're reviewing and say, okay, this is what happened this month. And then lastly, you want to write down your lessons. We suggest writing a minimum of three lessons for that month. And that'll allow you to kind of see, oh, wow, I learned something each month. So this is a great habit to do a monthly review. We understand that sometimes you want to do it and time gets in the way, but take the time. It really helps you plan for the next month.